Hey, how's it going guys? It's Rick again, back with another vehicle for you today. A 2002 Ford Econoline conversion van, E150 of course, and this one has the LA West conversion package on it. It is a high top. It's got 164,000 miles. This van is clean, 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 and I just drove it all the way down from Ohio. Let's get right into this 2002 Ford E150 conversion van. All right guys, so 2002 Ford E150 conversion van. As you can see here, it has the LA West package on it. Now, this package is complete with DVD player, uh, AM FM stereo, of course, 13 inch television in the back. Yes, the high top ceiling, the reading lights, the accent lighting, power seats, captain's chairs in the front and in the back, as you can see power rear folding mattress in the rear there and everything is it's like an oak finish got a lot of storage storage here storage here um, pretty much very very well taken care of van it was owned by an older gentleman uh, i did look at the carfax history on this vehicle it has an amazing carfax history report for the actual service on it the van um it has i think i saw it did have an accident on it front right corner uh looked to me like it's minor i haven't noticed any previous repairs on it even though it was repaired i'll take you out there in a minute and show you that the carpet is a uh, you know it's got some spots here and there it is a little dirty um i haven't cleaned it I haven't even tried to clean it. Only thing I did was wash the outside. I wanted to show everybody this video because I wanted to show you how the rear seats go down. So I just got the key in the ignition and our switches are right here. So we're gonna go ahead and that's front to back. Now in the rear here, you do have to flip this down to flip that part down. After you flip that down, then you can move it forward like this, and you can start laying it down. Now this is all electronic, all controlled by your hand, and that's a nice rear mattress there if anybody's traveling. Uh, cold AC. Obviously this is the captain's position here. Power seats. Everything works, the lumbar, the re reclining on it. Um, I got a bunch of manuals. Again, 164,000 miles, and I just drove this thing, what, a thousand miles? It's got a class three rear hitch on it. But basically, all the books are here from the original owner. Uh, I got every single trailer pigtail you can think of. Um, the camper wiring kit is included. Uh, this does have a class 3 hitch and uh, uh, let me see here 164,000 miles on the odometer start her up just want to give you guys an example of how quiet this motor is super super quiet the gentleman that had this very, 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 very well taken care of. This is how I picked up the engine, by the way. It was already detailed like this, everything. Uh, this was the actual spot of a repair that I guess was done. Um, I don't really see too much of a issue. I mean, it looks pretty darn factory to me. Uh, it could have even been a uh, you know a minor fender bender hit. I don't know, but uh, this van is super 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 clean, and it's available for sale. And I'm down here in South Florida. If you guys like it, you want to come and buy it, call me. Phone number is nine five four three nine four six five eight one. I'd love to show you the van. If you have any questions, give me a call. I do also ship across the United States. Shipping on this vehicle is quite pricey. Uh, I sh actually drove it because of 
the prices that I was getting quoted to uh, bring it down to South Florida at the time. Um, and I got quoted $1,500. I was really not happy with that price. So I said, I'm gonna take a little trip. Jumped in the plane for a hundred bucks and drove it down for about $150 in fuel. And it drove like a dream. Anyways, thanks for watching this video. Make sure you subscribe, like, post, comment, share. Thanks a lot, guys. Have a great day.